We're now on that disturbing body camera video from the San Diego County Sheriff's Department. It shows a deputy accidentally overdosing on fentanyl during a call. I spoke with the undersheriff today about exactly how something like this happens and what changes they've made to protect their staff. A dramatic video released from the San Diego County Sheriff's Department as a public safety warning about the opioid fentanyl. I'm Deputy David Fiveye and I almost died of fentanyl overdose. The body cam footage showing that deputy's partner administering naloxone or Narcan to reverse the effects of the overdose. The graphic footage raised questions about exactly how something like this could happen. So the thought is he either ingested it, he inhaled it somehow, some of the powder got into the air that uh, through movement or motion while he was testing it or perhaps dermally through his skin. Under Sheriff right. Kelly Martinez spoke to ABC 10 News Friday about the incident. She says the deputy was wearing gloves during the call. You can see him taking one of the gloves off when he collapses. Uh, he was done testing it, he thought, because it came back positive for fentanyl and then that's when he went down. According to a guide created by the American College of Medical Toxicology, for opioid toxicity to occur, quote, the drug must enter the blood and brain from the environment. Toxicity cannot occur from simply being in proximity to the drug. While it's still unclear exactly what happened in this case, the sheriff's department says it illustrates just how dangerous the drug is. As for what to look for, it's most commonly found in pill or powder form. It's a white powder in some of the forms. Uh, it looks similar to what cocaine or, uh, you know, would have looked like for a lot of people who recognize what cocaine looks like. Uh, the blue pills, uh, typically they're a, it's a small blue pill. Martinez says the department has changed its testing procedures, requires the use of protective equipment and... We always have someone else present when we're testing the drug, as you saw in the video, there was another deputy present. He had the presence of mind to have the naloxone handy and ready to go. And the sheriff's department also says they don't use canines to detect fentanyl because of how toxic it can be. Mm.